Have you noticed all the urgent care centers popping up lately around the tri-state? You know, it seems every major shopping center now has a health clinic. Well, there's a good reason for this, and they may be able to save you a bundle of money next time you're sick. Today's high deductible health plans mean a simple ER visit for a cut or cough can cost nearly a thousand dollars. Nine hundred sixty-three dollars and seventy cents was the bill for the emergency room. What do you think? I thought it was crazy. But people like Sue Knox now have other options. Urgent care clinics like Doctors Express are popping up everywhere. An emergency room can cost a patient between five hundred to a thousand dollars just for a basic type of illness or injury. Doctors Express opened a few weeks ago in Hyde Park Plaza next to the Hyde Park Kroger. Owner Mark Duffer says urgent cares can treat you for a fraction of the cost. The advantage is going to be the average cost is going to be closer to $150 to $200. If your plan still uses co-pays, those are lower too, $25 or $50 as opposed to $150 at a hospital. A physician, in this case Dr. Paul Nugent, is always present and can see you quickly. They don't have to sit in the waiting room when other things come in, ambulances come in, people jump ahead of them uh, in the line, the queue, because they have other more life-threatening issues. The clinic has a lab for blood work, an x-ray machine, and the ability to set broken bones and suture up cuts. Dr. Nugent cautions if you have a serious injury or breathing problems, you should rush straight to a hospital. But for basic issues like Lauren Perky had, you can save time and money. I mean, I got in and out of here in like a half an hour. It only took me 10 minutes to get inside. Now, what important disclaimer. We featured the new Doctors Express only as an example of the many urgent cares that are popping up around the tri-state. Neither I nor WCPO endorses Doctors Express, and I don't have any testimonials on the quality of their care. But if you want to avoid sticker shock at the emergency room, you might want to give one of these a try so you don't waste your money. Brendan and Janelle. Thanks, John.